This is our rocket here. Made with just bottles. We got some fins that we made from cutting out of another plastic bottle. And then we have this contraption here, of PVC pipe. A few odds and ends. A few zip ties here. That'll actually latch on. And hold it. But, that bottle right there gets pressure put in it. Now you can use a standard bicycle pump or any kind of pump. I have this electronic one here. Hook up to the car or hook up to a power source. Standard house. Once you get it there, you fill it up with air. That's your pressure. And we've actually gotten up to 50 pounds of pressure. We may say much higher we can go. But once you get your pressure in there and you put a little water in this bottle before you put it on, you pull down on that and the pressure will shoot the rocket up. But all in all, this little contraption here is very simple made. Found it on Amazon. You can find them all online. Just little bottle rocket launchers. Using nothing but water and air pressure. So, even if you go the cheap route and you use a bicycle pump, it's going to be a lot of fun and you're not going to spend a whole lot of money. Now, what do we see? Going up to thirty. Let's see. How is this going to work? With the water, it actually makes it a whole lot faster and makes it go a whole lot higher. Water. Well, JT, what are you doing? 50. Oh, yeah. In today's episode of Cheap Fun, we played with the bottle rocket and tape. So did y'all have fun? Yes. What, what was the best part? Will it crash into space? Will it crash into space? Yes, and we get to destroy it. Well, it looks like it got destroyed. What happened? Well, the top actually got broken. Plus, the top got broken? It. I need to save it. So what happens now? Sadly, we can't do it inside the house because it will broke our roof. It it'll, it'll broke our roof. Exactly, it will broke our roof. And have a tea party. But if anything, here, have the wig. Have fun with bottles, can't you? Yes, and I get the whole the curb, bro.